the iPhone 16 is perfect for Gen Z who are chronically online. Yeah. <laughs> Apple has officially dropped or announced the iPhone 16 and it's a total game changer for selfie lovers everywhere, particularly the young people. You know how we're always flipping the camera, fumbling for the volume button, trying to get that perfect 0.5 zoom shot? Well, those days are over. Why? Because this iPhone standout feature is a brand new camera control button located conveniently on the side of the phone. It's so simple, but also kind of genius, and also something that existed for Androids, as Android users will vehemently tell you. With just a swipe, you can zoom in and out or snap a wide-angle selfie. Perfect for getting the whole squad in one shot. Forget those awkward angles and missed moments, da 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 This new feature makes it ridiculously easy to take professional-level selfies all with one hand. I know for me with my current iPhone 13, I'd be having trouble doing all the, like, I, I feel kind of incompetent. Experts are calling it a direct hit for Gen Z for better or worse. Monica Hillison, a marketing professor at Virginia Tech, had this to say. This feature was absolutely designed with a selfie obsessed in mind. No more balancing your phone in tricky spots or stressing over the perfect angle. The iPhone 16 has your back, especially if you're someone who's addicted to your phone. This is the society that we've come to. Now, other than the camera, the iPhone 16 also has major upgrades. A bigger screen, improved battery life, which I feel like they say happens every time, and Apple intelligence powered by chat GPT. Imagine taking your Siri combos to the next level with more interactive and conversational features. Whether you're snapping pics or asking Siri for life advice, probably shouldn't do that, probably should go to a real person, the iPhone 16 is the ultimate sidekick for navigating your busy, digital-first lifestyle. And again, maybe a nice time to remind you to go outside and put the phone away, just if you want, just for a second. iPhone 16 hits stores on September 20th, which also is the same day that Katy Perry's album rolls out. Okay, timeliness, um, if, you if you watched the last video. It'll come in five colors, black, white, green, pink, and blue. Not only will your selfie game be on point, but you'll also be repping a sleek new design that's bound to turn heads. What about you? Do you think that the iPhone 16 is worth upgrading? For me, uh, 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 I don't know. Word on the street is the iPhone 17 is kind of the cat's meow. We got a full screen display. Those are just the rumors though, not facts. But somehow Mac rumors always seems to get it right. Am I the only one who thinks that? Like it's literally always like, this is just rumored and then boom. It's like Apple's trying to purposely feed this to us so that it can take even more of our money. Hmm. Thanks for watching. See you next time.